red. This present is pure, pure gold. Ooh, I like pure that. Pure gold. And you'll see why. Okay. Did you know you were going to get a gift tonight? No. Yeah? And I kind of don't want to ruin the paper. It's <laughs> so pretty. I don't want to mess it up. But well, I be have. gentle with it and you can recycle it and put yes. it in. You can, it can always wrap a smaller present. I'm uh -huh. going to slowly <laughs> open it up so that way I don't rip it because I love this. I've never seen That's good gold. wrapping nice like this. Gold paper. Yes. Wow, just give it to an artist and make it just look like okay, heaven. I'm going to take off the tape so that way it doesn't go back to being stuck everywhere. Yeah. Okay, okay. here we go. Okay. Oh, good. It's coming off without damaging the paper. Oops. Yeah. Gently. Okay. Pull this is like off. when Charlie opened his chocolate bar. He did it so slowly and gently to not rip the gold. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> and I... Okay. Oh, let me see. Let me see that. Aww. I really do not want to mess up the paper. Okay, I'm gonna go I'm glad you did not put a lot of tape on it. Wow, that's so beautiful. Okay, I successfully got all the tape off without ripping the pretty, pretty paper. Bye, lovely blow. <laughs> lovely bow. You could probably pull the bow off too. Okay. I don't. I seriously don't want to mess up anything. Okay, and get that up. Yes. There you go. This is amazing. I love this. I like making presents. I, you are presents. good at it. You know what? I'm going to take this <laughs> and I'm going to put it there. Yep. I'm going to tape that it's to a, that. It's a star with a comet tail. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to tape that. Oh, you're that so good there. at that stuff. You're going to be such a crafty girl. Okay. Oh, you you got to show Kim after what you sewed. You made an oh, invention. Yeah, I've been hearing. Your dad said you were going to start show, sewing and stuff. Uh, yes, we've sewed quite a few things. Okay, the moment of truth. After yes, trying not to rip anything. <sighs> oh, the places you'll go. Have you ever seen that before? Have you seen this? Have you ever seen this before? before? Have you read it? You must Maybe. have. I hope you have. I but this. I've seen it, but I've never read it. This one is your special copy because. I'll turn the next page. Breath. This is a girl. The coolest. Coolest book ever is it has the best ideas a, uh, about. about how to live your life, how to get out of jams, jams and make better plans. plans. Um, you'll always know that to do what to do, what to do um, when and brains in your um, toes. toes and feet in your nose. In your shoes. Oh. Shoes. <laughs> <laughs> You'll see from the start that if you're ready, really, really smart, you, you'll do the most wonderful job ever. Um, of just, of just um, um, being you. Being me. Yeah. Aww. Aww, this is so pretty. Okay. Oh, now. And remember, Dr. Seuss is see us. Now, I had to, uh, this is gen was gender specific, so we uh, did a little alteration. Okay. To make it, uh, that's you. Congratulations, today is your day. You're off to great places. You're off and away. You have brains in your head. You have feet in your shoes. You can steer yourself any direction you choose. You're on your own. You know what you know. And you are the gal who will decide where to go. 
you'll look up and down streets, look them over with care. About some you'll say, I don't choose to go there. With your head full of brains and your shoes full of feet, you're too smart to go down any not so good street. And you may not find any you'll want to go down. In that case, of course, you'll go out of town. Mm. This reminds me of Burning Man. Yeah. It's opener there in the wide open air. Out there things can happen and frequently do to people as brainy and footsy as you. <laughs> and when things start to happen, don't worry, don't stew, just go right along. You'll start happening too. <laughs> oh, the places you'll go. You'll be on your way up, you'll be seeing great sights. You'll join the high flyers, you'll soar to high heights. I love this one. Look at I love that place. I want to go live there. Yeah. That is so pretty. Isn't that fun? Yes. Oh. And just, here she is just sailing in the high, her high balloon. Yeah, I just want to do that. Yeah, <laughs> that's great. You won't lag behind because you'll have the speed. You'll pass the whole gang and you'll soon take the lead. Wherever you fly, you'll be the best of the best. Where, wherever you go, you will top all the rest. Except when you don't, because sometimes you won't. I'm sorry to say, but sadly it's true that bang-ups and hang-ups can happen to you. You can get all hung up in a prickly perch, and the gang will fly on, and you'll be left in a lurch. Uh-oh. You'll come down from the lurch with an unpleasant bump, and the chances are then you'll be in a slump. And when you're in a slump, you're not in for much fun, because unslumping yourself is not so easily done. You'll come to a place where the streets are not marked. Some windows are lighted, but mostly are dark. A place you could sprain both your elbow and chin. Do you dare stay out? Do you dare go in? How much to, can you lose? How much can you win? And if you go in, should you turn left or right? Or three quarters in a turn, or maybe not quite? Or go around back and sneak in from behind? Simple it's not, I'm afraid you'll find. For a mild, for a mind maker upper to make up her mind. But you're gonna be good mind maker upper. Because <laughs> you got good brains in your feet and your shoes. <laughs> you can get so confused that you'll start into race down long wiggly roads at a breaknecking pace and grind on for miles across a weirdish wild space, headed, I fear, toward a most useless place. The waiting place. Oh, no. <laughs> Going to the waiting place. Ah. And these are all the people who are waiting and waiting. For people just waiting, waiting for a train to go or a bus to come or a plane to go or the phone to ring or the snow to snow <laughs> or waiting around for a yes or a no, uh, waiting for their hair to grow. Everyone's just waiting, waiting for the fish to bite or waiting for the wind to fly a kite or waiting around for Friday night or waiting perhaps for their Uncle Jake or a pot to boil or a better break or a string of pearls or a pair of pants or a wig with curls or another chance. Oh, that's another chance. Everyone's just waiting. Nope, that's not for you. <laughs> Somehow you'll escape. All the waiting and the staying, you'll find the bright places where the boom bands are playing. Oh boy, that looks like Burning Man. <laughs> With banner flip flapping, once more you'll ride high, ready for anything under the sky. Ready because you're that kind of gal. 
And oh, the places you'll go. There's fun to be done. There are points to be scored. There are games to be won. And the magical things you can do with that ball will make you the winningest winner of all. Fame. You'll be famous as famous can be with the whole wide world watching you on TV. <laughs> Except when they don't, because sometimes they won't. I'm afraid that sometimes you'll play lonely games too. Games you can't win because you're playing against you. All alone, whether you like it or not, alone you'll be quite a lot. And when you're alone, there's a very good chance you'll meet things that scare you right out of your pants. There are some down the road between hither and yon that can scare you so much you won't want to go on. And you got to be careful about that stuff. Okay. But on you will go. Though the weather be foul, you will go. Through your enemy, though your enemies prowl, oh, you will go. Through, though the hacking cracks howl, onward up many a frightening creek. Though your arms may get sore and your sneakers may leak. <laughs> on and on you'll hike, and I know you'll hike far and face up to your problems wherever you are. That's really what it's all about. It's, yeah, you're going to have problems, but you, if you think and you care and you have a big heart, you'll find your way to all of them because there's no problem that your heart can't find a way through. You'll get mixed up, of course, as you already know, with many strange birds as you go. <laughs> so be sure when you step, step with care and great tact. And remember that life's a great balancing act. Just never forget to be dexterous and deft and never mix up your right foot with your left. <laughs> And you will succeed. Yes, you will. Indeed. One, nine, 198 and three quarter percent guaranteed. Kid, you'll move mountains. So, be your name Buxom or Bixby or Bray or Mordecai Ali Van Halen O'Shea. You're off to the great places. Today is your day. Your mountain is waiting. So get on your way. This is a great, great, <laughs> great, great, two months later, great <laughs> book. That was so cool. Let me see, turn it around, let me see it. Oh, and I like the cover is textured. Oh, yeah, yeah it's, it's an embossed. That's fun. It's really neat. Thank you so You're welcome. Well. You're welcome. Aww. That's something you just, uh, you just uh, put, put it in your treasure chest and see it's pure gold because the true golden life it's the true golden life is really wisdom and wisdom of how to live life and this man was really explained to all of us how to live life so brightly and enthusiastically and still be careful. This, okay, I think what my second favorite part of the book is the cover. I just really <laughs> like the texture. Pretty good. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Kim. You're we welcome. love you. You're I love Dr. Seuss books. Yeah, this he's great. This is so fun. He's great. That's just brilliant. <laughs>